Hey everyone, welcome to Atlas Gaming. Please like and subscribe. I release content every day. We're playing Cursed at Magic Cat. This is a free-to-play game that came out today on Steam. So check it out if this is something that you're interested in. Uh, this is... Today is January 6th of 2021. Anyway, so let's get into it. Press any key to start. Done. This is raw gameplay, by the way. I have not fired it up. I just uh, opened it, and now we're now we're here. I like all the UI design. Um, it's friendly. Kind of quirky. Find trophies to unlock cat colors selectable in the menu. Magnus the Great Wizard has cast a spell on you, turning you into a cat. He means to keep you in his mansion forever if you don't escape. If you use the... If you use three spellbooks first, you can undo your curse, but if he uses the three spellbooks, he could turn you into a cat forever. Luckily, there are ghosts of cats past to show you how. Nice. AKA tutorial. Okay, so these... I'm looking at the controls, um, kind of like in the center of the screen right now. Those are... <laughs> that was not accurate. That's WASD. Is uh, moving around like that. Space... Uh, there's E. Q is meow. Okay. And left click, right click seem to do nothing except the, the mouse just moves the camera. So, there's a spell book it looks like, right? I pressed E to claw out the spell book, collected it. Imagine that. Like a lot of other games. Okay. Ooh, just went right underneath. Uh, no button necessary. Okay. This is like uh, Titanfall 2 where they kind of like give you the ghost thing and they tell you... Hey, this is what it should look like. Oh, okay, so we got the camera kind of clipping through the wall there. Maybe it's a spy mode. Super secret spy cat, because see how it's like... It sounds like I'm, I'm kidding, I'm not though, because see how it's like uh, the little circle that opens up? And then on the other side, it's a, it's a, it's a circle. It's not like um, normal clipping where it's all messed up and glitchy looking. Okay. Kind of cool, actually. So, Maelstrom Potion, let's get it. <laughs> Breaking stuff. Oh, let's see, okay, so I'm gonna claw it. Oh, like, serious Maelstrom, jeez. Okay, so this is a game that's, um, it was made by, by graduate students at the Southern Methodist University Guildhall. Teleport Potion. I kind of like... Okay, well... Oh. Oh, nice. Okay, so it just teleported me automatically. That was all uh, scripted, I guess. So, cast three spells first to break your curse. Oh, okay, so it's... Hey, there's a little bit of stealth going on. And that's a... It's a wizard with no H. Just a wizard. Oh, no. He saw me. Get out of here. <laughs> it's kind of cool we get to be like the mischievous cat. And I, I know that I can just go places where he probably can't come. Because... Oh, you can see in the top right. That's our sound. Okay. Or is that our stealth detection level? Not sure yet. Okay. And so, uh, we have two books so far. It's a mortar and pestle. Oh, no, it's not. It's a ladle and a bowl. Okay. <laughs> oh, shoot. Magnus. Hang on a second. Oh, so, okay, you can see the top middle. There are... <laughs> no! So there's only one more. We're gonna go get it. So there are five books total, right? Um, is what I'm guessing based on the the bar in the upper middle. And so we have... Oh, he cast a spell. Shoot. Okay. I was a little bit slow there. I was really slow there because... Um, <laughs> even after I had figured it out, I still I still didn't really take action. Anyway, uh, Alakatzam. The wizard sounds gleeful as he casts a third enchantment. You feel your human form slip away a little more, and your memories of your life before the curse become fainter. You need to try again to escape. Okay, that's fine. Are you sure you want to restart the level? Well, heck yeah, I do. 
Okay, and, uh, the description on Steam is uh, it, it reads as follows. Magnus the wizard has cursed you, turning you into a cat. Lift your curse and take your revenge by meowing, hiding, destroying things, and collecting spellbooks to break the spell. Curse That Magic Cat is a lighthearted single-player game made by students at SMU Guildhall. Um, we've already read this, so we're going to go ahead and... Okay, I kind of get a better feel for this. Um, I'm going to I'm gonna follow my, my inner cat instinct. And um, really embrace the, uh, the mischievous kitty. Maelstrom! That's my favorite one, by far. Oh, did it just... Oh, okay, uh, maybe that was a little bit dumb of me, but, um... Okay, I see. So the, the maelstrom is like that little dome that's around the cat. Um, if you didn't see that, you can rewind it, but there's like this kind of... It's a white, hazy, translucent, sp almost sphere that's around the cat. Okay, here's one. Oh. So he knows where we are as soon as uh, I get a book. I No? As soon as I get a book, I guess? And so, like, the, the Maelstrom oh. Potion, you just, like, go through the place um, wrecking house. Come and get it. Come and get it. Okay. No, no, we're going to get it this time. Collected a spell book. Poof! As a third spell book disappears, you can feel the wizard's curse weakening. Uh, in case you, well, you can't see because I don't have it recording, but the steam overlay just gave me two achievements. Actually, pretty cool little pictures. Anyway, you can feel the wizard's curse weakening. Your human form is easier to remember than before. You are one step closer to escaping the wizard's grasp. Nice. And so you can see up here, uh, one, two, three, and they're on the kitty side. So we got three books. I'm not sure what this is. Maybe it means he just caught us. So victory, destruction. Ooh, and we get like a grade too. We get level grades. Like um like a, a star system, except it's the the Pentagon system. <laughs> okay. Next level. Magnus will open doors to new rooms when not angry. Oh, okay, so there's like an angry meter. Cool. The living rooms. Magnus must have left some spell books here while he was doing some light reading in between turning people into cats. Cool beans. Let's go get them. What's all the... What are the fireflies? Okay, we can't scratch any of those things. Here's one spell book. Okay, there's one. That must mean he's angry. The thing on the kind of upper right. Oh, no, he's totally coming. He's beelining right for us, so... We're gonna come up here. Oh, what was that? What, something just happened. Oh, cool. Look at this. When I said something happened, I meant, like... Oh, shoot. Come over here. Um, I, I swiped that little crystal ball, and then he immediately turned around and went the other way. Let's try to... Okay, and we're gonna use our super special cat spying powers. To look through the wall. That's definitely clipping. <laughs> I think. I don't know. I can't really tell. Oh, look at the cat's eyeballs. <laughs> oh, he got a book. Shoot. Oh, here, look at the cat's eyeballs. I need to take care of business. There's one. You've collected a spell book. So we're looking uh, up high now. Uh, now that I know that's a thing, I'm looking up high. And I'm trying... Okay, he opened a door. He must have opened a door, right, to get in here. Yeah. There we go. I'm looking up high. You can see, like, these little holes um, up high in the wall. Um, I, I wish I kind of had a cursor right now, but I don't. I just pressed Alt. Left Alt, and it took the menu. It brought the menu up. You can see right there on top of that shelf, there's a little hole in the wall, right? That's what I was talking about. Anyhow, let's go to this potion. What did it do? I don't even know. There's another magic ball up there, I think. Or magic orb sphere. Oh, we're going all fast. That's what it did. Heck yeah. Go. Yep, so once again, we are going up high-ish. We're trying to get over to right here. There's a book. So I think that's it, right? Take that guy. Another achievement. Mission impossible. <laughs> okay, sorry. Poof. 
As the third spellbook disappears, you can feel the wizard's curse weakening. Your human form is easier to remember than before. You are one step closer to escaping the wizard's grasp. Okay, cool. Zero destruction. I gotta get better at that. That's okay. Your final score ravages your stealth, speed, and destruction. Yeah, good deal. Kit. Kit. Oh, I thought. <laughs> I wanted to say kittens, because we're in a cat game. Kitchens aren't a typical place for spell books, but Magnus has enough dessert recipes scribbled in the margins between spells that there have to be a few here, too. Okay. I I like... This This might be... I'm just going to pause it so I don't waste time trying to find... Or uh, my, my time trying to find the books and Magnus gets ahead. Anyway, I just wanted to say... Uh, kudos to the developers because this is probably uh, my favorite startup in recent memory of a, of a new game. Um, very little uh, tutorial because there didn't really need to be. Um, the controls are really just intuitive. It's very straightforward. And if you've ever spent um, you know a little bit of time playing video games, getting used to the WASD keyboard controls, you'll you'll fit in right just just fine. <laughs> so I really like that. A lot of games I play. Um, there's just too too much too much tutorials and like the game's so complicated that it, it needs the tutorials because you have to learn all these different elements like UI and they're trying to reinvent the wheel it seems like sometimes. And so yeah, anyway, I just wanted to say that kudos. Um, this has been very enjoyable for the first eleven minutes. <laughs> okay, so we got a book there. Get out of here. Okay, now we're speedy. Speedy McKitty Cat. Oh look at him, look at Magnus! Oh wow, he's um, he's a lot faster than he looks. He got us. Oh, is he gonna put us? Okay. Huh. You're not gonna get me, Magnus. Oh, maybe you will. <laughs> That's fine. Okay. What's this? Okay, so we broke it. Okay, he opened a door for us. Awesome. We have one book you can see in the top middle. I see another book over there. And Magnus is... What? Oh, there he is. He's way over there. Okay. Again, to get a book, you just go up to it and you press E. Like, super intuitive. It's great. Is he on to us? Or is he just mad? No, I think he's just mad. And then, I don't know what that sound is. It looks like, um... We're on a countdown timer. I'm trying to get the dang chicken. <laughs> We're on a countdown timer. Oh, we can't even get the chicken. Uh, for him to not be mad anymore. Oh, shoot. What was that sound? I'm looking for more books. I can't... I can't tell... Oh, there we go. There's just a hole. We can just go straight in. I can't tell if it's clipping, like the, the camera. <laughs> Trying to make some noise here to get him to come over here. <laughs> oh, shoot. Okay. Getting too rambunctious. Get in there. Yeah, good kitty. Maybe um, that wasn't the best one, though. Oh, shoot. Losing the lead here, messing around <laughs> in the, uh, the storeroom with the, all the fish bones in the chest. Nope. Okay, okay, okay. Um, whoo, get down there. No, dang it. He's gonna win this one. Okay, come on. Come on. Okay, and whoo. And there, and there. This is what I was trying to do. No! We'll be a cat forever! That's all right. That's the end of this one. Go check this game out. It's called Curse That Magic Cat. Free to play on Steam. Came out today, January 6th of the year 2021. Thanks for watching Atlas Gaming. I appreciate it. Please like and subscribe. I release content every day. We'll see you in the next one.